Welcome to Abstarpress. Does deleting a post or page deletes its attached media files from WordPress as well? Nope. By default, when you delete content from your WordPress website, regardless if it's a post, a page, a product, or any kind of post type, WordPress keeps the media files previously associated with it, even if after the removal of your content they are not used anywhere else. Let me show you. Pages, add new page, test page, add media, upload files, open, insert and page, publish, view the page. And here is the attachment or image. Media library. Now here is that image we just uploaded. Okay. Move to trash. Page removed. Refresh media library. And the image is there. Go to trash delete this page from trash now it's completely gone reload library and the image is still there so the post was removed or page was removed but image associated with it is still here okay deleting a post or page should delete attached images or media files from wordpress Otherwise, extra unnecessary media files will add up in system forever, wasting hosting space and slowing down your site. You don't want that. Delete all of your attached media files to your posts once they get deleted from the system. Get rid of all unused attachments and images from WordPress. Delete images that are not used with posts, pages, custom post types, WooCommerce product posts, and also posts from easy digital downloads once they are deleted let's delete this image manually so the image is gone from the media library go to plugins add new search for delete attached media and we've got few options dx delete attached media delete post with attachments auto remove attachments let's try dx delete attached media install activate and that's it let's create a page add new test page 2 add media Select the file, insert into page, publish, and in library, we have got this image now. Okay, so move to trash, page deleted, file is still there, go to trash, delete permanently. Reload media library page and the attachment or image gone that was associated with that page. So file deleted when page was permanently deleted. File will automatically be deleted once trash is deleted. We can restore pages, posts from trash, right? That is why media file was still there in case we want to restore post or page. But once trash is emptied, image or media attached to post or page that was deleted will also be deleted by default in wordpress trash is deleted after every 30 days if you want to empty trash sooner you can add one liner in wp config file this is wp config file at the top use this one liner define empty trash days one 
change days to two, three, or whatever you like, and that's it. Alternatively, you can use a plugin named as change empty trash time to adjust time to empty trash. So anyways, this is how you can auto clean media library each time you delete a post page, product or custom post type. Also alternatives to this plugin are auto remove attachments, delete post with attachments. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe and I will see you in the next video.